Love for Food here and today I'm at Los Guachos in Columbus, Ohio trying out some of the best tacos in the city and their homemade horchata. So here's the horchata. This cost two dollars. Got no ice so I didn't get the shaft. So let's give it a shot. Really nice. It's got some grit to it. Not as, as gritty as other homemade horchatas that I've had before. Very sweet. Tastes a little bit like rice because it's made with rice. The sweetness kind of tastes like it's coming from honey. There's a little bit of cinnamon flavor, but overall this is really good. Not the best homemade horchata I've ever had, but I'll probably give this a four out of five because it's up there. Now let's go ahead and try the tacos that they're known for. First is the al pastor, which is barbecued pork, and the second is the fried fish taco. So let's go ahead and take a closer look at these. On the right you have the fried fish taco. You can see it's nice and battered. Got a red sauce on there, pico de gallo, lettuce, and this flour tortilla, which is grilled. And hiding underneath is the smaller al pastor taco. This has nice shaved chunks of pork on there, onions, cilantro, pico de gallo, and it looks like a spicy sauce. Let's go ahead and give it a shot. First up, the fried fish taco. Mmm, that's really delicious. It's kind of like a spicy sour cream sauce on top, that red sauce. That's some really good pico de gallo on there. Tasting the garlic, tasting the onions, really, really fresh. The fish is fried to perfection. It's really crispy, very, very nice, battered. A lot of flavors going on. I really appreciate that spicy cream sauce that's on there. The fish on the taco is a little more like fast food fish, a little bit lower quality. Kind of had this overwhelming taste of a fish. Not like a cod or a haddock, which is a little bit more buttery and uh, subtle in fish flavor, but this was pretty pretty pronounced, which I think on second thought was kind of taking away more from the taco. Um, so I, I did appreciate that crispiness. The batter on there was really awesome, very crispy, uh, lots of flavor on the batter. But I prefer it if it was a little bit less fishy tasting and less overpowering. So I'm going to have to give the fish taco a three and a half out of five. Not the best fish taco I've ever had, but that batter was really good. Let's go ahead and try the Al Pastor taco. Mmm. Awesome. That Al Pastor meat, you can see, it's nice and crispy. They actually have the Al Pastor on this big um, rotating like skewer and they shave it off and there's like there's a flame on the other side that's grilling it so you get it kind of nice and caramelized and crispy mmm salty smoky crispy that's awesome really good flavor to it this taco is really good I'll probably give this a four and a half out of five this is an awesome Al Pastor better than a lot of the Al Pastor tacos I've had before now in the restaurant, they actually have these pickled spicy uh, onions and peppers. And I asked for some to go. So let's try those on this. Ooh, that's spicy. Definitely some habaneros in there, getting that habanero flavor. It's kind of pickled, so getting some of the vinegar and then the onion, which tastes like a cooked onion, but it's probably just been sitting in the the vinegar for a while. So that's really good. Add some nice extra spice and extra oniony, vinegary flavor. Really like that on this. So you have it, a couple items from Los Guauchos in Columbus, Ohio.